Ana de Armas and Ben Affleck split up in January 2021 after dating for less than a year in breaking news that was first reported by People. I'm a little bit of a mess. Can you tell? The duo was first spotted together in Cuba in March 2020, immediately sparking rumors of a connection. A source told E! News at the time, They have been kissing, cuddling up together, and putting their arms around each other a lot. They look at each other adoringly and like taking pictures of each other. Ben seems blissfully happy and giddy. He can't stop smiling and laughing. He clearly is very into Anna. By August 2020, Dearmas was spotted moving her things into Affleck's Los Angeles home, according to People. A source told the outlet, She had a huge grin and seemed very excited about living with Affleck. Despite all of these happy milestones, they still decided to call it quits a few months later. But there's one detail about De Armas and Affleck's breakup that seems a little unconventional. Turns out that the pair broke up over the phone, according to Cosmopolitan. That's surprising, considering De Armas had reportedly moved in with Affleck. But who knows, maybe they were working on projects in different cities at the time. Apparently, there wasn't any major drama that caused the breakup. A source told Entertainment Tonight, Ben and Anna have split up and Ben is single. They had little arguments and bickered like any couple, but ultimately the relationship just wasn't working in the way they both wanted it to anymore. This was a mutual decision. The fact that their breakup was amicable and mutual is really positive. But what was the clincher that caused the split? A source told People De Armas didn't want to live in Los Angeles anymore, and some sources are saying that there was a rupture about having more kids. Here's the inside scoop on that situation. Affleck shares three children, Violet, Serafina and Samuel with his ex-wife Jennifer Gardner. But this was no problem for De Armas. In fact, many sources confirmed that she really liked Affleck's kids and made an effort to get close to them. An insider told E! News, Anna loves kids and couldn't wait to meet them and spend time with them. She knows how much they mean to Ben, and so she was anxious to be a part of that. She is very sweet and kind to the kids. They immediately warmed up to her and like her a lot. While De Armas was fond of Affleck's kids, sources told Page Six that a big reason for their split came down to the topic of having more kids together. One insider explained, He would not commit to having more kids. She's in her 30s. It was a deal breaker. De Armas has no children of her own. Another source told Page Six, Ben is not in a place to start a new family. Both he and Anna have three jobs lined up. His family has and will continue to be his focus. These are legitimate issues, but is it over for good between De Armas and Affleck? While breakups can be shocking and devastating, they don't necessarily have to be permanent. Affleck and De Armas broke up on good terms, as a source close to People said, they are in different points in their lives. There is deep love and respect there. With all that love and respect as a foundation, many sources are hinting that the split might just be a hiccup on the way to a happy future. A source told Page Six, they could get back together. They are in love. People who know them believe it's temporary. I've missed you. That makes sense since they seemed so in love. Even Jennifer Garner was supportive, as an insider explained to Us Weekly. Jen has completely moved on from Ben in a romantic sense. She considers him a friend, thinks he is a good dad to their children, and respects him. She is happy in her own life and supportive of him and happy for him in his relationship. It's a great sign that everyone around the relationship is so supportive, and maybe Affleck and De Armas will get a second shot at love after all. Anything is possible. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more Nicki Swift videos about your favorite celebrity couples are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.